All right, hello everybody. This is the bus driver and I'm here to take you to school. We're back with some more NHL 16 via GM with our Washington Capitals fantasy draft. That's what I'm looking for. This is either season four or season five. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure it's season four and I got my numbers wrong, but who knows. Anyways, we are at the trade deadline. There's no one I really want to move. Uh, we are 46, 12, and 2. Like, you don't mess with something that's working. We are good. We are young. We'll only get better. So let's just keep it moving. Unless there's a trade that floors me. Two first. Nope, not interested in Strawman. Actually, you know what, though? Take a quick look. No, thank you. I'll take a quick look at my lines, though. Just to make sure I really don't need a defenseman. Jack Eichel, you're happy to be here. I'm glad. That medium franchise. Hey, Jamala. Nice to see you. Thanks for coming out. We're just uh, running our Washington Capitals fantasy draft team right now. At the trade deadline in year four or five, something like that. And just so you know, here's our lineups. We are currently in the President's uh, Trophy uh, position, so I'm not going to make a trade here at the deadline. And we don't really need a defenseman. Strawman's an 85 that they keep trying to push on me. And we don't really need him. No, I, I don't like it. I don't think we need him. Top six, technically. Top six. Minor top four. Uh, Fram shouldn't be up here, but oh well, he's not doing bad. I guess. Yeah, nah, he's been doing well enough, actually. This is... Yeah, I went to school with the brother of Fram. That's kind of funny. He's a plus 13. Yeah, he's good. He can stay. He's doing very well. But we're going to keep it as is. I don't really need Strawman. He's not going to fit in anywhere special. Big win against Chicago. The Kushkin's back. In time to play Ottawa. Kushkin was Descharnay. Okay, we'll put Nikushkin back in. And Nikushkin was always our third liner. Yes, he was. Oh, he rebroke his foot. Oh, I took a gamble and it didn't pay off. Shit, we rebroke his foot. Oh, uh, I, I first I did it to Ehlers. I rebroke his leg. He went from he went from three months out to six months out. Now uh, I did the same thing to Nikushkin. Oh, I rebroke his foot. Now he's out for another two months. Oh shit. Ehlers is back. All right, there's enough time for you to get better. So you're going in. Oh, I feel so bad for having done that to Nikushkin now too. Oh. The coach shouldn't have let me do that. Oh, that's terrible. Your depth still. Your third still good. Oh, that's hilarious. I can't believe I did it again. Okay, here we go. Keep this streak going. Ooh, lost a mini. That's right, they're in the west. Ooh, don't like losing to Pittsburgh. Because they're right behind us. And then Jersey's right behind them. Not a fan of those kinds of losses. Oh, it looks like Nedekovic's going in net. Finally again. This is, probably, this is probably his first start in the last two and a half months. Maybe it's his second. I just know before the trade deadline, he hadn't played in two months. So, uh, here we go. Let's see what he can do. Oh, beauty. 3-1. Way to go, Nedekovic. Let's do these forwards while we're here. And we'll go do goalies. Ooh, big wins there. I am a fan of this kind of stuff. Uh, player morale. We've got some to deal with. Tavares is happy. I'm glad you're happy. 
We still need to get rid of Mike Green. He's a he's a cancer right now. And we will. We will move him around. Probably we'll just not sign him next season, which is... Oh, that's not what I meant to do. 69 games played out of 82. Uh, about a month left. Big win there. Don't care about the West. We can lose to the West. Broken ribs. Ooh. That's not good for... Uh, uh, what was his name? Starts with a V. Oh, well. Can't remember. Storm's in. Here we go. Big win there against Anaheim. Lost to Boston. Hate losing to the East. Don't want to be losing to the East. Oh, there's chemistry to be done. More player morale. Mike Green, I know you're pissed. You hate everything and everyone and anything and every... Duh. That's right. I really shouldn't have signed him for that two-year deal. I thought it was one dumb of me to make it two. Ugh. I didn't think you'd get this pissy, though. But Whatever. What are you going to do? Big win against New Jersey. They are right behind us. Oh, and Huberto's injured. Okay, so we'll move Terra Vinen up. Actually, you know what? Benson, how about you move up, buddy? Benson's moving up, and we're gonna put we're gonna put Fontaine in for you. There we go. Hopefully he's not out for too long. Hubert O, I think it was a concussion. Is that what I read? Or a contusion? Big win against Winnipeg uh, there in the West, but that isn't okay. Do I leave? I'm gonna leave Nikushkin out until he's fully, fully healed this time. I'm not, not going into the playoffs. I'm not doing this again. So let's see. Any morale? Huberto's only out for seven more days. That's good. I'm not re-breaking his leg, so that <laughs> that's not gonna happen. Uh, three days. I can wait that long. And then we'll do a recap after this too here you go with two weeks left to go 77 games played Tavares just hit 100 points Jack Eichel 98 right behind him and Hubert O's got 75 so he's a point per game that's great for a first liner you want at least a point per game Benson's got 55 on the third line he's going straight up to second line next year easily uh, he is minus seven though. That's probably just because he's on the third line. Uh, Zykov's 54, second line sniper, not bad. Dalcall, third line. Maybe Benson, Zykov, Dalcall next year. That'd be a hell of a line. Uh, Klingberg, Teravinen. Yeah, you you could go down to the third line, Teravinen. Right side on Strom, third and fourth line centers. Who's not doing well? Morrissey, I'd like to see more out of you. Nikushkin, I definitely want to see more out of you. But you've been injured most of this game. Fram's not bad. Eight points. Plus ten. Pretty good. Pilington, seven. I'd like to see a little more out of you. But you and Fram, you know you're doing your best. Ehlers, I'd like to see more out of you. But uh, what are you going to do? And then goalies. Just real quick, before we finish off the last two weeks... Gibson's goals against is now up to a two. Our defense has uh, been slacking. Nedekovic, you've lost a few more games, it looks like, but what are we going to do? Oh, and then let's see. Oh, we already clinched the presence trophy. Really? That didn't take long. Or is that just the division? Which one's Zed? Is that the division? I like how there's no... Uh, there's no... Uh, legend. But anyways, so... Let's go take a look here. Yeah, we've clinched this one. If they win their next five games, that puts them at 20. So we'd have to lose all but two games. I doubt that's going to happen. And they'd have to win them all. But we'll see. There's always a chance. You never know. Knock on wood. Okay, here we go. 
Zykov will be back for, or not Zykov, Nikushkin will be back for this game. So let's go till then. Big shutout against Philly. Goalies next, goalies. Three, five, three. I hate the red, I can't read it. Is that a zero or a six? I think it's a zero. Zero, four, four, two, four. Not a lot of goalies left to, to pick from. Okay, now Kushkin's back. Fully healed. We'll put him in first. Dylan Strom had a good game, apparently. Oh, no, he had a bad game. He lost morale. No, you don't deserve to be scratched. You were injured, buddy. Jeez, quit your... You re-broke your foot after I put you back in too soon. Don't you complain. There you go, Nikushkin. There you go. Now you won't re-break that, that foot. Hopefully. Finish off this half a week, and then we're into the last game of the season. Ooh, overtime loss. And Hubert O's back. Perfect. We'll put him right in. Ninety-three overall. Hubert O. Back out there with Tavares and Eichel. Jack Eichel. Jeichel. Come on, beat Boston. Ooh, loss. Okay. Fifty-eight. Oh, we're not gonna get a sixty-win season. That's all right. That would have been funny. Where do we sit? We have 119 points. We clinched it easily. I would have loved to have seen that 60 win season, but that's all right. We already know we made it. Oh, and we lost to Joyzy too. That sucks. Okay, all right. Old team meeting. We won the President's Trophy. Great, great job. Very proud of them. Our morale's only 86. That's not great. Okay, let's do a quick recap of the season for all everything. Points in 82 games. Tavares had 104. Jack Eichel with 99. How many? Tavares. He had how many last year? He had. He's had three 50 goal seasons now. That's not bad. This is easily his best year. 104 points plus 43. They killed it. Those three, just killed it. Definitely better than last year. All right. And then Jack Eichel. He had a 99 point season. There you go. Plus 39. 20, 99, so close. 74 assists. Very good. Easily his best season, although that one was pretty good too. Um, anyways. Uh, Hubert O. 75 and 76. Point per game. I will take it. Zykov, 56. Benson, 56. On the third line, might I add. He only had one point in like two weeks, though. Uh, who else here? Bertuzzi did pretty good. Morrissey, would like to see a little more out of you. Fram and Kling. Kylington, a little more out of you guys, but you know what? You were all plus, so that's good. Uh, goalies here. Two points for Gibson. Not bad. Nine shutouts. Is that what I just saw? Nine shutouts. 49, 17, and two. Almost a 50 win year. Holy crap. That's amazing. Holy shit. How did the Kovic... Oh, because he probably got pulled and some of them are played later. Anyways, all right. Um, let's take... Sorry about that. My uh, batteries finally just gave up, uh, like I warned you. Anyways, um, where was I? 
Oh, I was going to do the whole league. Let's see. So, four wins was Gibson with 49. Second was Flurry with 39. He had 10 more wins than any other goalie in the same amount of games. That's incredible. His save percentage was pretty good. Same as Howard's. 0.925 is not bad. Um, his goals against was very good too. Better than all these guys as well. So he's probably got the Vesna in the bag. Ooh, Bishop had 10 shutouts though. Just beat him. Oh well. He had 9. Same with Lundqvist. Okay. That's goalies. Let's check out defensemen. Points. Let's see. 71 points for Carlson. That's a lot. Holy crap. And then next was 50 for Oliver Ackman Larson. That's a huge difference. Klingberg came third, though. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. If it wasn't for Carlson, he would have been uh, in the race there. Uh, anyone else here? Dougie Hamilton was up there. Morgan Riley's a 95 high for, oh my lord. Look at him go. Hampus Lindholm, there's another good one. Eric Pouliot's down there. Okay, all right. Um, forwards next. Let's see. Points. 104 points for Tavares. He wins it by a landslide. Jack Eichel, a close second. Or, well, it can't be close if he just landslided it. But anyways, he's second. Very good for him. Uh, ooh, it looks like Sagan beat him out for the scoring title, though. Stamkos was up there. Voracek, Taves. Ben, and then the rest are all under a point per game, which is kind of surprising. Let's double check. Yes, Sagan just beats out Tavares for the Art Ross. That hurts. Oh, well, that's okay. So there's that. We're going up against who? Columbus? Is that who I saw? We're going to check their stats. It is the Blue Jackets. Okay, so we're going to check their stats as well. Of their team. The Columbus Blue Jackets. CBJ. Alright, let's see how they're... Ooh, they have Sam Bennett. Interesting. Okay, their best player, Corey Perry. 92 overall. Bergeron, 91. Ooh, there's a good... 1, 2, 3. Ooh, and Gaudreau. There's their 1, 2, 3. They were very low in the points department, though. Very low. Sam Bennett, second line center. Eric Stahl's the left winger on their team. Interesting. Then Sherback. Ooh, high elite Sherback. He might grow. Marco Dano, I've seen him grow. Brett Burns, their big defenseman, 90 overall. Ryan Pulak. Jake Vertanen. Vertanen, sorry. Sajak. Oli Mata is an 89 high elite. Holy shit. Oh, well, there you go, <laughs> Dickinson. All right. Ooh, Jack Johnson's over there, too. Didn't we already play Columbus before? Rook Chartier from the uh, Kelowna Rockets. Duncan Siemens is over there. Okay, he grew. Oh, and Noah Yulson's down in the uh, AHL again. Uh, all right, looks like they got hit by injuries, too, here. From the looks of it, James Reiner, Reimer is their goalie with uh, Rory Kempoli as their backup. Ooh, he's a medium franchise. They got to give him more time. Give him more time, man. Oh, man, they are going to be very good if he grows. Okay, and let's take a look here. Progress reports. All right, a little bit out of Kylington, a little bit out of Benson, a little bit out of Descharnay. A lot out of Studnika, Suzuki, Paquette, Vermistrov. Okay. All right, Damien Ryan grew a little bit. Matthew Barzal. All right, he's got to come up next year. 
All right, well, that'll do it for this episode. For those of you watching on YouTube, thanks a lot. Take a look in the description below for my information, youtube.com slash bus driver, twitch.tv slash bus underscore driver, and at bus driver on Twitter. All this spelled with an L through US. Hit those like buttons, hit those follow buttons. You can see when I'm live, join me in chat. I appreciate when you do. Other than that, I'm going to take a quick break, and then we're going into the first round of the playoffs. So stick around. I'll see you, right? I'll see you again soon. Take care.